Today's project is to ground my station equipment. And so the electrician friend of mine gave me this gizmo from a electric switch box. And it's uh, got three copper plates, which I'm gonna drill and tap so that I can uh, put bolts in and uh, run ground strap from all my equipment. So here I am, this is the uh, quarter 28, I think it is, tap. I'm drilling and, and threading these uh, holes for the bolts. Copper is a pretty soft metal, so it's easy to drill, easy to tap. So once I get, oh, I'll probably have uh, eight or ten of these places where I can run ground strap. Here's a piece of emery cloth. You can use that to sand off the uh, copper, or you can just use this bad boy here to clean up the copper. Now here it is. I've mounted it on the uh, shack wall and you can see the grounding strap that's a braided strap there's the copper wire that goes outside to the ground rod and this copper strap is half inch wide and I've run three straps one to my radio one to the uh, power supply and the third one went up to a uh, antenna switch so finally I've got the tower up in my A1S Cushcraft beam antenna which is a nice directional antenna and so I can finally turn on the radio and tune up and uh, see what kind of reception I'm getting right now I've got it set on uh, 20 meters 14 megahertz and my favorite mode of operation is Morse code CW and so here I'll just copy down uh, see if I can catch his call sign we send ham ham operators send these cards back and forth they're called QSL cards and that's my favorite one it's from uh, a ship out in California the Queen Mary here's just a bunch of uh, cards I've got up on the wall some pretty cool ones this is my card my call sign is N2 RGT here I am putting out a call calling CQ so we send CQ CQ and then give the call sign N2RGT so here we go looks like we're on the air